excuse me. Hi everyone, welcome to another echoey corner of my living room. Wow, we're getting to see it all, all in these videos, look at that. <sighs> Today I have a fun video coming towards you guys. I hope you enjoy it, because I don't know if I will. But my friend Lindsay and I challenged each other to do a truth or a dare video, yay. And you guys sent me in your truths and dares over on the Instagram and the Twitter. But if you would like to see Lindsay go through the same torture, you can check out her video. It will be in the description down below. L over on Twitter. Yeah, it's just it's just an L. Um, friendumxlove03 is the username. She asked, truth, what was your most embarrassing moment while performing? Well, I've had one or two of those. <laughs> My most embarrassing stage moment was probably when I was playing... Belle. Belle in Scrooge, and I was young Scrooge's love interest, and there was this scene where all the villagers had to come out and we did this really intricate circle dance, but I had a quick change, so I ran off stage before that scene, got dressed, and when I was just about to step out on stage, I took one step on stage and my skirt fell down. So I just did what seemed most natural, and I hauled up my skirt and did the whole dance with one hand and holding onto the skirt with the other. It was... Funny. LOL Heart 7182 says, I dare you to hop around in your PJs in your neighborhood and say, I'm a fluffy unicorn. I am a fluffy unicorn. I am a fluffy unicorn. I'm a fluffy unicorn. There's no one around. <laughs> better when your neighborhood's really busy. Brenda CXX dares me to prank call someone you haven't talked to in a long time using a weird voice. A lot of you want me to do prank calls, so who haven't I talked to in a long time? Let's prank call Kelsey and and see what she says. Hello. Hi, I'm just wondering if you would like uh, pizza toppings on your pizza? Uh -huh. Oh, you have caller ID, don't you? Yeah. I was dared in a video to do a prank call. <laughs> oh, okay. Well, hello, video. <laughs> you, it's a truth and dare video, and you and I used to do lots of truths and dares. Why don't you give me a dare? Um, okay, one second. I have to collaborate. Um, I dare you to put your foot in the toilet and flush it. I knew you were going to say that. <laughs> <laughs> That's what we always used to do. Oh, I haven't done that in so many years. It's going to be refreshing. Thank you, Kelsey. <laughs> You're welcome. Bye. Bye. Okay, here we go. Let's put my foot in the toilet. I got my towel. I got my toilet. I think this is a no makeup venture, so... Um... <gasps> gross! Gross! Oh my god, it tickles! It's warm! <laughs> ew, 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 ew. What's that? A nice little uh, spa session? <laughs> Highly recommend it. <laughs> Lots of you are daring me to do my makeup without a mirror or with my eyes closed. I think you guys just want to see how how ridiculous that is. That is not gonna work. Okay, let's try it. Oh, I apologize. My nails are so chippy. I need to paint them. Uh, I'll put this on. I feel like my feel for for where I put my makeup every day might be okay. So I'm gonna be using this little palette from Sephora that has, you know, I think some really great colors in it. Nice base color, crease color. I'm just gonna keep putting this dark color in my crease because, I don't know, maybe we're gonna go for a smoky eye. This is what I'm most nervous about. <sighs> that might be joined, I don't know. All right, color it in. I feel like I have a lot of practice doing this from playing cranium so much with my sister, where you have to close your eyes and draw certain things and then the other person has to guess them. I'm scared of mascara anyway. I think I might have got some on my eyelid. Ow. Now for blush, I'm gonna use this really fun one. I got MAC, um, their space collection. I really like this one for summer, so, you know, maybe we're doing a little bit of a nighttime summery look here. I feel like I'm not putting enough on. Is that a thing? And you can complete a look without lipstick, so I'm going to apply the most difficult lipstick I have, which is Lush Santa Baby, which requires a brush. <laughs> but I've somehow have misplaced my brush, so I'm going to be using this angle brush that's normally used for brows. Let me see what it looks like. Oh my, I'm looking in the viewfinder. The lips aren't too bad, like they're not quite Miranda Sings, but you know, 
the like midway there. My Lado Quitecker says, I dare you to sing your favorite Disney song. Oh, that's a really nice dare. Okay, what's my favorite one right now? Oh, Tangled is my favorite movie, so let me sing something from that. And at last I see the light, and it's like the fog has lifted. And at last I see the light, and it's like the sky is new. And it's warm and real and bright, and the world has somehow shifted. All at once, everything is different now that I see you. Avery G201 dares me to eat a spoon of mayo. This is not gonna be enjoyable for me. <laughs> All we have is Miracle Whip. It's a good thing I'm hungry. Rachel62319 gives me a truth and it says, how many boyfriends have you had? Like high schooly, junior high boyfriends that like none of those relationships lasted very long, but I guess they count. I would say over 10. I've had two serious boyfriends, I guess you could say. Um, the first one I went out with for a year before Michael and then Michael and now we're getting married. Joy love having ZX tells me to twerk in front of the camera. <laughs> oh, I can do Miranda style twerking. Yeah, right. It's Iris Ja says, truth, what is the strangest dream you've ever had? I had to tell you guys this one because I totally saw a ghost the other night, but I'm pretty sure it was a dream. If it was a real ghost, that'd be really scary. So what happened was I was asleep and Handsome was sleeping next to me, but he wanted to get out. So I got up and opened my door so that he could get out. When I closed the door and went back to bed, I looked up and there was a translucent face floating across my room and out the door. I was up all night. I was so terrified. Ugh, even thinking about it gives me cold shivers. But what I think happened, or what I hope happened, is that I was still half asleep when I let the cat out and then like my brain was still dreaming or something of this scary face. <sighs> Saint Capel dares me to call my best friend and tell her that I'm pregnant. Well, I just called her, so I don't think she's gonna be too surprised, but let's call her anyway. Hello. Oh no, Kelsey, I'm pregnant. Oh shoot. Oh shoot. What will we do? <laughs> I don't know. I guess we're going to post it on the wedding. Oh, that's it. I won't fit in a dress. Anyway, guys, that's all the time I have for Truth and Dares today. I hope you enjoyed it. So this video made me realize I have the nicest subscribers in the world. You guys asked me to do nothing really scary, but I love you guys. You're too nice. If you're not already one of my super nice subscribers, you can click that subscribe button and have future updates on my future videos. And you can also find me on all of my other internet homes on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter. Don't forget to check out Lindsay's video. I know she got some really, really hilarious dares and I can't wait to see them myself. Oh, it's gonna be so awesome. <laughs> I hope you guys are having a lovely week and I will see you in my next video. Bye! Let me pick you up in a video before... Look at the handsome... Oh no, he hates me.